In this video, we're going to discuss whether the Fun Spot parks are worth visiting. We're going to discuss the rides, the pricing, and much more. So stay tuned. Now, the Fun Spot parks are most known for their rides. Both parks in Orlando and Kissimmee offer a standout wooden kosher, with the Orlando location having White Lightning, a GCI wooden kosher, and then the Kissimmee location having a much larger Gravity Group wooden kosher that goes upside down, known as Mind Blower. Both parks also have their supporting koshers, which at Fun Spot Orlando you have Freedom Flyer, which is a Vacoma family suspended kosher, and then at Fun Spot Kissimmee, you have a bit more offerings, which you have Galaxy Spin, which is a Zamperla spinning wild mouse, and then you have Hurricane, which is a fun family kosher with some pretty steep drops for a family kosher, to be honest. And I think it also delivers some pretty decent airtime as well. But the other things that the Fun Spot Parks are most known for is their plethora of flat rides, which includes many of the staples you expect at carnivals along with SNS Scream and Swings, Frisbees, and much more to suit your needs. Then you also have their impressive go-kart tracks that are always fun. The other thing they're mainly known for is the Sky Koshers. Now the one at Orlando is the smaller one at 250 feet, which is still huge. But the more impressive offering is at Fun Spot Kissimmee, where they have the world's tallest Sky Kosher at 300 feet, which is in my opinion insane. So if those rides interest you at all, then in my opinion, the Fun Spot Parks are probably worth visiting. On to a unique thing that you get access to with the Fun Spot Parks, and that's Gator Spot, which is an aquarium focused on gators and crocodiles that's not too far away from Fun Spot Orlando. As I previously mentioned, you can see gators, crocodiles, and they also have animal shows, and also you can feed some birds and whatnot. And it's not like a huge place, but it's definitely something to consider if you're interested in animals and you want to spend more time at the Fun Spot Parks. Gator Spot is a great way to do that. To the tickets, which is in my opinion the most important thing to consider when you're planning on visiting an amusement park. <laughs> now, this is kind of funny. But the ticket prices at the Fun Spot Parks have increased a bunch, as on their website they advertise their tickets at like $45, but in reality they are $60. Now you do get a decent amount with that ticket, as it includes the park and the aforementioned Gator Spot, but one thing is, one important note is that if you want to visit both Fun Spot Orlando and Kissimmee, you will need to pay an extra 10 bucks to visit both, which would make that 70 bucks. So if you think all this stuff is worth it with the rides, Gator Spot, and you think the tickets are a good value, then I would say the Fun Spot Parks are 100% worth visiting. Now, my best tip with the Fun Spot Parks is do not visit after a day at Disney, Universal, or SeaWorld. In my opinion, you should plan a separate day where you spend half a day at Fun Spot Orlando, then a half a day at Fun Spot Kissimmee. That way you'll get the most bang for your buck. And also another important thing to note with the Fun Spot Parks is that there is free admission. So if you're going as a family and you know there's some people that aren't interested in writing anything, they don't have to pay a single dime. That's a big plus that the other parks in Florida do not offer. So if you enjoyed this video, thank you for watching, and also remember to like this video and share this video with anybody you know who will be visiting Orlando or Florida in the near future. Also remember to subscribe to Southeastern Thrills, and peace.